Hey guys and welcome to my channel. So in this video I want to go ahead and play around with the Juicy Blueberry Palette from Gimme Glow Cosmetics. This was a two palette launch um, so they did release the uh, Butterfly Vibes Palette which I do also have but for this video I want to solely focus on the Juicy Blueberry one. So here's what the packaging looks like. It does retail for $45. There are eight mattes in here and then two multi-chrome shimmers. So here is what the palette looks like. This is different packaging than what they've done in the past. It is the cardboard packaging, which I like and I dislike. I don't really know my thoughts on the change of packaging yet, but I do like that it is sturdy. It's this very beautiful, like, purple-blue palette. Look how stunning that is. And the two shimmers in here are to die for. I'll go ahead and do a finger swatch for you guys. They are just so beautiful. I do have one shimmer on my eyes today. So I want to go ahead and play with this and um, give you guys my thoughts on it. Overall, I want to say that it's a really great palette. The mattes are super pigmented, super buttery, super blendable, and the shimmer shades in here are stunning as well. Um, this one right here, the shade, what is this one? Bake Sale Queen. I really can't wait to do like a smoky eye with this one. It is the most stunning shimmer I've ever laid my eyes on. So I'm very happy with this palette. We're going to be doing the tutorial portion for you guys just to give you guys a sneak peek of the Butterfly Vibes one. This is what this palette looks like. I will have a separate video coming up after this one on this palette so keep an eye out. So without further ado, if you are interested in this eye look that I have on my eyes today using the Juicy Blueberry Palette from Gimme Glow Cosmetics, then just keep watching. So starting with the first shade, I'm going to go into Lick the Spoon and I'm going to start placing that on the outer crease. I'm dabbing on and then I'm going to take a bigger fluffier brush that's clean of all product and blend out the edges. So right now I'm just packing on the color where I want. I'm just trying to get the shape down since this is the lightest shade that we're going to use. Um, so far, all of the mattes are really buttery and smooth and pigmented. I really, really like this palette, so let me know in the comments down below if you guys picked up one of the palettes, either the Butterfly one or this one. Um, Gimme Glow Cosmetics is one of my favorite brands in the entire world. If I had to say my top, like, five favorite, like, indie brands, I would have to say Gimme Glow Cosmetics, Blend Bunny Cosmetics, Unearthly Cosmetics, and, um... Hmm. What are the other two really, really good ones? All right. So those are my top three, let's say. Um, I should definitely do like a top five, um, you know, like palette video. Maybe I'll do that in the future. I'm not sure. But to deepen up this look, I did go into mini muffins. And this is, again, a dense packer brush. Just doing some windshield wiper motions back and forth. Usually Gimme Glow Cosmetics, um, like the darker matte shades, are really, really intense. So I like to take a little bit at a time and then build it up. Um, and then again, I'll take a clean, fluffy brush and just blend, uh, lick the spoon and mini muffins together. Um, after that, uh, I did take a little bit of lick the spoon, just a very small amount and put it in the front portion of my eye. This is just an overall just kind of smoky, soft cut crease look. So nothing too intense, nothing too crazy. Um, and then I did end up going into just a white sh uh, matte shadow. You can go into any white matte shadow uh, you want. Oh my God, I am so out of breath. I tell you what, I thought having a kid, you know what I mean? You're out of breath in that third trimester, not in the second trimester, but I am out of breath all the time. Oh my God. Anyway, so I took a fluffy, um, clean blending brush and just dipped into a white from a palette and dusted that on the edges just to make sure that it was nicely diffused. Then I went into the shimmer shade. I placed down some glitter or some, yeah, some glitter glue first, and then I put down sugared blueberry drizzle. The most beautiful fucking shimmers. I'm sorry. Ooh, the most beautiful shimmers I have ever encountered are from Gimme Glow Cosmetics. If anything, I and you've never tried the brand, I highly, highly recommend getting their shimmer singles and trying them out. They are the most stunning formula ever. So for my winged eyeliner, I did go in to the P. Louise paint in the shade of Golden Treasure. I wanted to stick with the like pop of yellow that was in the palette, so I just did a quick eyeliner look. I did forget to film like an outro, so here's kind of just 
the picture that I took for the thumbnail just to show you guys the look all together. Um, the bottom lash line was just the same colors that I had used on the top portion. Again, that P. Louise winged liner on the top lid for the winged liner. So that is pretty much the look. Just a simple, quick tutorial. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Leave a like on this video. It really helps my channel out. Comment down below if you guys have picked up this palette. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you the next time that I upload. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.